So why would anyone want to demaster a song? Well, without going into too much detail about the loudness war, the mastering process, or the current music industry, there are numerous reasons. Many revolve around creating headroom where there is none, and many other reasons involve the revival of musicality into a song destroyed by poor or overmastering. Making headroom in a mastered song is necessary when adding vocals, making a mixtape, or preparing a song for a remix, and much more. Also, revitalizing the musicality of a song just makes it nicer to listen to. Before we begin, here are three waveforms. The top is the unmastered version, but it is limited to roughly 0 dBs for easy AB comparison, with the middle waveform, the mastered version, which was professionally mastered by a relatively big studio, who I will not name. Which to you looks more like music and less like a rectangle with a tail. Looking at the above waveform, you can almost see the different parts of the song. One might venture to guess that this relatively quiet part here is the buildup. Now say I want to add a vocal track to this song. If all I have is the mastered version, I would need to make enough headroom for the vocals. And just lowering the volume wouldn't necessarily work because the vocals wouldn't sit right in the mix. They would sound separated from the track instead of part of it. To properly demaster a song, you'll need two plugins. Fruity Multiband Compressor and a free VST effect by the name of Dominion version 1.2 by digitalfishphones.com. Back to FL Studio, load Dominion onto your mastered song's mixer insert. To learn more about Dominion, click the annotation you see now, or check the related videos section. For now, just know that you need to tune Dominion to the loudest part or instrument of the song. So in this case, it is the kick drum. So the attack length within Dominion is set to the attack of the kick. and the sustain length within Dominion is set to half of the kick drum's decay. Too long of a sustain would create an unwanted effect. Decompression presets by Audio College for Dominion are in this video's description below for free download. Now once Dominion is calibrated, you'll want to split the audio into five frequency bands with Fruity Multiband Compressor. If you do not know how to frequency split, pause this video and watch our frequency splitting video series. Now that you know how to frequency split properly, the band overlap created further increases the average dynamic range of the song. So you'll need to lower the out mixer inserts level until the audio no longer peaks. Do not just add a limiter to the insert. That defeats the whole purpose of what we are trying to do, which is create headroom and revitalize musicality and dynamics. Another benefit to frequency splitting is that you can now raise or lower individual bands to your liking. Whether it's to raise the bass levels up a little bit, or if demastering to add vocals, you may consider dropping the mid and or high bands a few decibels, creating plenty of headroom for the vocal track. Another technique is to add subtle sidechain compression to the mid and high bands controlled by the vocal track's amplitude. This way, the song parts without vocals will remain unchanged. To summarize, first load and calibrate Dominion into the mastered song's mixer insert. Then, take the output signal of Dominion and frequency split it into five bands. The band overlap created by frequency splitting with Fruity Multiband Compressor will further increase the average dynamic range of your song, thus creating more headroom without changing the overall sound or quality. However, it will drastically change what the overall waveform looks like. So now you can fight the loudness war, demaster poorly or overmastered songs, expertly create headroom without changing quality, bring musicality back to harsh sounding songs, or even remaster a song.
For more videos on decompression, mastering, frequency splitting, and much, much more, check the related video section now. And don't forget that all available free downloads are in this video's description below.